River City is a fictitious place that is overrun, worn down, the economy has died. Tell them about Old Carver. There's, I can't tell you about Old Carver. There's nothing to do, the kids are bored, the booze is cheap and the girls are easy. It reminds us of our childhood. <laughs> the end result is this gigantic, thick, layered album that does warrant multiple listens. We weren't on anyone's budget, we weren't on anyone's watch. We just went in with a clean slate and... It was wrote, very challenging. Wrote the album we needed to write. Yeah. This is our bread and butter. This is what we love to do. I mean, every album was, you know, had its pros and cons. The only con about Carver City was that it might not have ever gotten finished if we didn't realize how important it was. I mean, it's all there and everything that we wanted to do is there and it makes sense to us and that's all it's important and the fans. So getting out and being on tour, especially with Carver City to promote and a new label behind us, the, the fans we've always had, getting back out, it's, it's incredible. I, I, it's not like I forgot how good it is, but it's, it's definitely something you can never take for granted. And I think a lot of bands do. I am no good at putting this into words and I don't give a shit. It's not so much the traveling, the clubs, the going around and seeing new places. It's the, this is our livelihood. This is what we enjoy doing. Everyone in this band has been touring since we've been, what, 17, 18 years old? It's all we know. We're still stuck in a, a, a time in our life where music is all that matters.